Hello guys, this is Percy again. Today we're gonna talk about Pisac, the beginning of the sacred belt of the Incas or the Condor Mountain. The sacred belt of the Incas is known worldwide for its ancestral legacies and architecture. There is one town in particular where the majestic of its greatness lies built upon a mountain above the banks of the Urubamba River. Pisac is a primary example of this legacy built upon a mountain, sometimes at these heights that defy the laws of nature. To arrive to this site, one must approach the sacred valley from Cusco, heading towards the province of Calca at a distance of 19 miles from the city of Cusco. This destination represents of the greatest manifestation of agricultural technology that also fulfilled crucial ceremonial and administrative functions in this area of the valley. The weather of Pisac is temperate throughout the year and similar to the city of Cusco and the region in general. There are two well-defined seasons, the dry season between April and October and the rainy season between November and March. Its temperature, depending on the season, ranges from 39 to 76 degrees Fahrenheit. The origins of its name, according to the Cusquenian historian Victor Angles Vargas, can be traced to the word Pisac, derived from the Quechua word Pisaca, that refers to an extinct partridge bird, whose shape can be seen built into the archaeological site, but only when one is high above. Ethno-historians date suggest that this area of the valley was populated by the Ayarmaca and Pinawas ethnic groups before the Incas. Pesach was ordered to be built during the time of the Inca Pachacutec, and according to some historians, it was taken as his hacienda or country house. There is no doubt that Pisac was one of the first and the largest producers of corn in the Incan Empire with up to four types of terraces in its construction. Among its main archaeological zones we can appreciate the following. In Tiwatane Quarter, the most central and sacred neighborhood home to temples and palaces with a superior architectural quality, exceptional precision in its stone walls and larger enclosures in relation to other sectors. The Intihuatana itself stands about all as an altar carved out of volcanic rock which serve both astronomical and religious functions. Sector Calla Casa this is the highest and the largest neighborhood in this area. It has 36 enclosures, 19 patios, passageways, stairways and towers, among others. In general, the buildings in this sector are of rustic masonry, making it a pre-Incan citadel, however, it was reused and adapted by the Incas. The Incan Cemetery or Necropolis. Located below the Lili Mountain, deep in the ravine, we arrive to Tantanamarca, the largest Incan cemetery known of more than 5,000 tombs. Practically all of them were pillaged by the Spanish conquerors when they arrived in the 16th century. Largely due to the custom of the Incas of burying their dead with treasures. Bisak literally is one of the biggest Incan cemeteries that we have in the valley, also because the mountain has the shape of the condor, and the condor was the only being who brings your soul, your spirit from this level to the cosmos, which is representing the eternity. Bisaka neighborhood. This zone was built high above an important agricultural sector of more than 40 platforms that descend all the way to the Chongo River. This area is without a doubt 
one of the most beautiful in all of Pisac for its aesthetic qualities, with more than 23 structures built within its riches. Towers of Pucaras Pisac is confirmed of more than 20 towers that took watch of its surrounding lands and skies. Due to its location, Pisac likely controlled movements of all those passing through this area of the valley and the neighboring access to the jungle. In times of war, these towers would have served as strongholds. In essence, within the archaeological park of Pisac, we find neighborhoods, aqueducts, roads, accompanied with walls and gates, channels, waterways, bridges, etc. This archaeological ground covers an area of 4,000 square meters. In addition, the modern town of Pisa holds one of the most outstanding traditional markets covering the main square and surrounding streets. Here one can witness an endless variety of crafts, textiles, traditional food and native products brought from high Andean communities of the Sacred Valley. The ancient site of Pisac remains an impressive feat of engineering that challenged the law of nature in such a rugged location. One can only imagine the great accomplishments of the Incas, transforming an entire mountain site into endless terraces and impressive structures built upon decent heights and high summits. Thanks for watching, we are in Kaini Peru Tours, please subscribe, like and share our videos on all your social media platforms, see you next!